Hey, uh, good afternoon, Calgary. Uh, this is Alan Claussen uh, coming to you from here in Bonesse, uh, proud Bonesian and proud Calgarian. Um, I'm part of the Brookfield Properties Development Group and uh, been working in the uh, in the community for uh, well over 30 years and uh, incredibly proud of our city and proud of the people that uh, we're able to connect with. Uh, totally realize that um, the situation that we're in right now with COVID-19 and the impact that we're having, that it's having on uh, all of our companies, big, large or small, our families, our society is just devastating. And uh, number one, uh, my heart and my prayers go to all the families and, and those that are dealing with the disease itself. Um, in my mind, I think the number one priority that uh, we all need to be concerned about is our health and safety of one another and making sure that we're doing what we can to uh, keep our social distancing, uh, staying at home when we can and really being respectful of uh, the one thing that can really uh, nip this thing in the butt and uh, that's to really stay home and uh, start to see the curve go down. I just want to talk to you really quickly about my opinion. Uh, I am uh, an optimist. I, I believe in, in Calgary. I believe in the people that we've got living here. Uh, we've been going through a tough time over the last number of years uh, with what's going on with oil and gas and uh, with uh, a lot of different issues that are, you know, uh, both uh, within the city of Calgary as well as around the country and around the world. Uh, we're a resilient group and um, I really honestly believe that through this challenge and through this tragedy that there's going to be a lot of good that's going to come out of it. and. I think uh, that one of the things that we're going to really learn again is really the importance of connection and how important it is to uh, uh, stay united as one and, and, and build relationships. And, and, and maybe we've taken a few things for granted. Maybe we've taken the simple uh, idea of having great relationships and being connected to one another for granted. And now that we're in isolation, we've got to find more creative ways to do that. And, I really believe that there's uh, an opportunity for the city to really bounce back. I, I do believe that once we're through this and, and uh, hopefully that sometime over the summer and going into the fall, that there's going to be a high level of pent up demand that we're gonna be able to get people back to work, uh, that our governments are doing the right thing to be able to uh, support small businesses and individuals to get through this tough time. Um, but I just want to encourage all of you to be positive, uh, be strong, uh, be confident in our community, uh, and, uh, and really continue to, uh, stick together as we work through this. Um, this is a terrible time, but it's also an opportunity to reflect an opportunity for us to be able to really engage and an opportunity for us to lead, uh, as a city and as a nation. So. I just want to say best wishes to all of you, uh, wishing you all the very um, best in terms of your health, uh, your family's health, uh, your mental health, uh, stay active, continue to uh, really reach out to people in different innovative ways. And we're going to get through this Calgary and we're going to be stronger because of it. Thanks so much. God bless. We'll talk to you soon.